Good morning. Good morning from Melbourne, Australia. Good evening to friends in North America and hello to anyone watching on replay. My name is Nancy Hetker and I'm an independent stamina demonstrator in Melbourne, Australia. And today I wanted to remind you that we are halfway through our um, seasonal sale and there is a big sale on annual catalog products, stamp sets, dies, and uh, designer series paper. The non-specialty designer series paper is all on sale. Um, so anything in the July to December mini catalog is not on sale, but stuff in the annual catalog is on sale. So today I decided I was going to make a card that featured a couple products that are on sale. A um, couple of my favorites, uh, the Picture This dies, which I think do get overlooked in the annual catalog because they don't have a co specific coordinating stamp set. Hello Gladys, thanks for joining me today. Um, but I love, I love the funky, offset shapes um, and you can use it um, with the negative which is what I'm going to be doing today but you can also use it to cut out um, these stitched shapes and I have done that as well um, and you use the positive parts cut out um, and I'm going to use that with the elephant parade bundle um, now, one of the things to note about this sale that's going on, when you buy a bundle, you get 10% off, but if you want to buy things that are normally bundled in the annual catalog during this sale, put them in separately, you will get a better deal because I think it's 20% off stamp sets and 10% off dies. In any case, it comes out a better deal. So. Be sure that's just my quick tip for you. So I'm going to be using these three items, the elephant parade, the coordinating dies, and then the picture this dies. And I have gotten my act together enough for this. Hi, Caitlin. Thanks for joining me this morning. Paula, hello, nice to see you. Um, so, I decided I wanted to use, um, man, I really want to call this Tempting Turquoise, but it's not. It's Tahitian Tide. Um, and I've got another layer, basic white. And then I took some of the 22 to 24 in color glimmer paper. And I don't know if you've seen this product it's very glimmery and it's also ombre it goes dark to light and so I took a piece of the Tahitian Tide see I got that right and I've gone ahead and I've cut out that circular picture this die and like I said we're going to use this is the negative um, but I've kept all of these because they will be fun on a project at some point and you can see they are a bit ombre. Some are a little darker, some are a little lighter. Of course, you can see that better if I actually had it in the camera. So there we go. I'm gonna set those aside. And this is going to be our card base. And you guys need to give me some feedback. Do you like it better when I'm starting totally from scratch? Do you like it better when I've pre-done some? Um, last week and this week I had all of my coloring done. Last week I had my cutting out done as well. Today I don't. So I, I'm never quite sure if you want to sit there and watch me color all of these or just some of it. Um, but I, I went ahead and colored these in already this morning. Um, you can see some of the, um, the color variation that I got by using the light and the dark blends. Um, just putting in a bit of a shadowed area on parts of it. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna 
take a moment and cut these out now. Hello, Renata. Thanks for joining me. Are you getting snow where you are in Virginia? Yeah, I'm glad I see you got snow. I know some of my friends in Champaign, Illinois got some snow. And I know uh, my friend in Colorado got snow. She's at a higher elevation than where my son is, so I'm not sure if he's getting snow. Um, anyhow, we had a little retur mini return to winter here. It's chilly and rainy yesterday. Uh, sunnier, but still chilly today. Now that's not gonna fit through my mini, so I'm gonna trim that down a little bit to be able to I think the mini is easier to use on camera with you guys so set that one aside for now hello Roseanne how are you today thanks for joining me and let's see which one we've got here Stand up here for a minute so I can see better. Yeah, I love these elephants. They are very, very cute. How many can I cut at once, do you think? We'll see here. At what point I decide it's not worth it. I'm gonna keep going. No, I'm gonna stop there. Okay. Let's see what we got. Very sweet elephants. Now I usually go back and forth, but just because of where everything's positioned, I can't see so well on that side to position dies. So I brought it back over. Peanuts here. Whoops. Oh, we're just going to do that one and come back out. My little mouse. Oh my goodness. I just flip my plate over, 
see if it will go a bit flatter that way. And let's see. Do the standing up again. Yeah, yesterday morning and this morning I had to put my longer sleeve shirt back on. By the afternoon I switched to short sleeves, but it's a little chilly here this morning. Come here. I think you are going to be taping down. Kate, it looked like you had a great time at on stage. one. Where'd the other one go? Sorry, I need to look for that die because it's itty bitty and if I don't find it right away, there we go. It'll be gone. I know it's much better about not eating things, but I worry. Actually, right now he can't pick anything up off the floor because he's in a cone. He, uh, got his dew claw snagged on something Saturday morning, so we had to take him to the vet, and he had the whole thing removed, and wrapped up and cone of shame and antibiotics and pain relievers and the whole bit. So he's, he's out of the bandage. He's still in the cone for the rest of the week. He's finished all his meds. He's yeah. Okay. So I've got two different sentiments stamped. I'm not sure which one I'm going to use, but I wanted to show you. I'm going to, I think I can do this here. I think that will fit through. I'm going to position this. In here to cut out. does just fit through there <laughs> and there that gives me on the circle if I want it okay so now I'm gonna start putting stuff together
what's the best way to assemble. I think the best way to assemble is to go ahead and put this. Double check this here. We may lay it all out here and make sure. But we like what we've got. Here, come here. So something like that is what I'm thinking. So, how am I going to do this? Don't squeal. <laughs> yes, I'm ruthless. At times. Okay, so I am going to use this dimensional to adhere the elephant to the glimmer right where I want it. See? And I'm going to bring this one in. Took me a long time to be able to not go ah when I started cutting things off. But you know what? Cut off or tuck back behind, it's not going to be seen. So there you go. Okay, that one's in place for now.
go. What do you think? I think we're on the right path there. Okay, so now I'm gonna bring in, I have these foam adhesive strips and I do have some leftover bits from cutting things out. So I'm gonna use some of those. I think they are the same thickness as our regular dimensionals. So give a holler if I'm work if I've moved off camera and I don't seem to have noticed. Give me a holler and say, "Hey, can't see what you're doing." get some pretty good stability in here. And the, the one challenge with all of this is to get it straight onto this piece. <laughs> that's that's going to be my biggest challenge, I already know. But we'll work on it. And yes, you can use the edges from your regular dimensionals too to fill in some of these. But And of course, I could put just a couple of regular dimensionals in there too, which maybe I will. And not. Use all that up. Okay. Get my mouse out of the way. Get rid of all the trash. I'm going to use my grid paper to get this pretty straight. And I'm going to use a little bit of that. it down in place. Okay. Okay, I believe I have them all. So I 
think that's reasonably straight too. Ha! See, when you take your time, there we go. Yay! <laughs> okay, so continuing on with things to add. I've lost my little mini dimensionals. Oh, there they are. Duh. Okay, I'm going to put on that one for a moment. things pop it up or yeah there we go And where's the mouse? Where'd you go, mousey? I put you up here very deliberately. Oh no. Here, mousey, mousey. Ah, there he is. He, she, it, the mouse. Decisions, decisions, decisions. Do I want to do something like that? Do I want to just get rid of those? Come here. Oh my goodness, they're hard to pick up. So. I could do that, or I could do that. You like the no peanuts.
Anybody else want to weigh in? And I probably wouldn't do them just like that, but it would be some little pile of peanuts over there. Yes, this is true. My fingers aren't working with these little bitty things today. Peanuts between the mouse and the elephant. That needs to go smaller, I think. Hold on one second. I'm not sure it needs to be stitched. There we go. I like that better. And I like that, that, yes, just that little mat. <laughs> okay, so let's see, this needs to get added on.
you see what I did there? I put the dimensional down in the hole and then I lined this up where I wanted it. It's not centered on the hole, it's offset. Um, but it's better in that space, I think. Um, so, now we need to do the peanuts. I like them there, I think. Yeah, somehow it kind of helps ground it. One flat. Okay. Like so, yeah. Yeah. Okay, bringing in a little bit of tear and tape. I want it flat, but the glue won't stick on the glimmer. So here's some tear and tape. Okay, and now this, once again, we're gonna to try to get this straight. <laughs> go. What do you think? Good. Thank you all for your help and your input. That is pretty darn close to what I envisioned, but better. I like the, I like those. So, thank you all for joining me today. I will be back same time, same place next week. If you American Stampin' Friends can drag yourself away from your Thanksgiving prep, I would love it if you would join me. Um, we haven't even discussed what we're doing for Thanksgiving or not doing for Thanksgiving here. So, yeah, we'll just see what happens. But, okay, I will see you next week. Don't forget to take advantage of this sale. It's a good deal. I got my order in yesterday. Um, yeah, so enjoy, and I will see you next week. Bye-bye.